All right, guys, we got a 2011 Volkswagen Jetta with a 2.5 liter engine and uh, something something real interesting on this one. So uh, let me show you what's going on with this one. This car comes in with a P0106, which is a code for a map sensor, which I'm holding here in my hand and um, change the map sensor. I actually did some wiring on this car. Let me go show you where the wiring is at. So let me put this sensor here and I got a map sensor here. So the wiring that I fixed is down here. I think you can see those four exposed wires. Those were actually touching each other and, and giving us a map sensor code. Now the map sensor sits right here in the middle of the screen, right behind the throttle body. So if you need to change that out, you have to remove your throttle body. Something interesting on this car is that over here behind this intake boot sits a sensor just like that. And that right there is your SAI sensor, and it looks exactly like your map sensor. That sensor bolts on exactly the same. It has the um, same connector. They look exactly identical. The only thing that differs one sensor from the other is the part number. Okay, so if you get these sensors mixed up, which is what happened in this case, you're going to get a map sensor code and you're going to get a secondary air injection sensor code. So the one thing I don't understand is that this map sensor right here is a four wire sensor. That secondary air injection sensor is only three wires. So why would they design them the same way with four pins on each of the sensor? Why not make this a three wire sensor with three pins and the map sensor? Uh, four wire sensor with four pins right so anyways uh, if you're getting a p0106 which is a map sensor code go ahead and check your wiring for that sensor check the map sensor and also check for a dirty throttle body and any intake leaks which you may have uh, pcv system on this one is very common and um, a dirty throttle body is also going to give you a P0106 map sensor code. Now what happens here is we had a mix up with the sensors and there's actually a TSB um, for this. So let me go ahead and show you what that looks like on paper. All right, so here's that TSB for the P0106. And you can go ahead and pause it here. But pretty much what it's saying is that the map sensor uh, uses a part number from the manufacturer that starts with 03C. And the SAI sensor uses a part number that starts with 07C. See this one right here in my hand, on the bottom you can see 03C, 906051. That is a map sensor number, part number. On top, uh, 02612309.5, that is a Bosch aftermarket number. This one right here, 02612230234, is also a map sensor. So this car had two map sensors installed when it was supposed to have one map sensor and one SAI sensor. So we went ahead and got the correct sensor. And here's a, here's a box for the SAI, uh, secondary air injection sensor. You can see the part number starts with 07C, just like the TSB states. So pretty much what I wanna show you guys is if you have a map sensor code, make sure you get the if you're going to swap out your map sensor, make sure you have the correct part number. Always double check your parts, whether it's from Bosch or from BWD or wherever you're getting it from. And cross-reference your part numbers if you don't have the OE part number on there. So remember, 03C is map sensor. 07C is a secondary air injection sensor. So don't get those mixed up. This is it for this P0106. I just thought I'd share that information with you guys because it's very important. Not only is it going to throw you in a loop, but you're going to get a P0106 map sensor code and you're going to get a P2431 or P2433, which are secondary air injection codes. And if you don't check these sensors and make sure that you have the correct one installed, make sure you don't have a map sensor with the SAI ghost and make sure you don't have an SAI sensor with a map ghost, uh, then it's going to it's going to be a long day for you. So very simple check check these part numbers out i still don't understand why they would make both of these sensors four pins when one of them is only a three wire sensor so anybody out there um, that works on volkswagen's humble mechanic positive lead can you guys explain this to me or is it just a vw fuck up so um i'll leave it at that 
map sensor P0106 or P2431 or P2433. Check your sensors and that might be it for you right there. Have a good day, guys.